instead of selling a promotion. Uh, and pray. All right. Uh, at the last meeting and the meeting before that, there was a uh, motion made about recording of the meetings, and this body voted not to allow those recordings. And, uh, my understanding is someone has a recording device they need to remove. It. So, uh, 2023 Code of Alabama, Title 36, Section 25A 6, recording of the meeting. A meeting of a government body, except while in executive session, may only be recorded by any person may be re openly recorded by any person in attendance by means of a tape recorder or any other means of sonic, photographic, or video reproduction provided the recording does not disrupt the conduct of the meeting. The governmental body may adopt reasonable rules for the implementation of this section. Can you please explain uh, how we are openly violating a state law? I don't believe you are openly violating a state law. Y'all have never adopted any rules or regulations concerning the recording of meetings. You didn't do that at your initial meeting. You started recording these meetings, and this body voted one night to stop them. This body is a majority, and they have the right to rule. They don't have the right to contradict and, and convert a state carpet, uh, contradict the state law. You just said that if it disrupts the meeting, then they have that right. And it's obvious it's disrupting the meetings. Here we are, 15 minutes in, and this is what we're debating. Not from the recording. It's the That's exactly what we're asking you to do. Stop the recording. No, no, it's the, the camera is not disrupting anybody. Mr. <laughs> you have that right. If you feel that your rights are violated, you have the right to file a civil action to do that. Yep, that, that has begun. And the, the claim has been but tonight, for this meeting to go on, you have to stop the recording devices. So the choice is yours. When you stop the meeting and not have it, or you can stop the recording devices. stand firm that you're violating state law and, and also my uh, constitutional rights. And I appreciate that. That's not the issue. The issue right now is the meeting's been called, mm -hmm. their meeting's been adopted, the agenda's been adopted, mm -hmm. and the chairman is asking that you stop the recordings according to the resolution that was adopted. The resolution is invalid mm -hmm. because it violates state law. All right. The next option that they have would be to have someone escort you out or escort the stuff out. That's your choice. Yeah. Uh, make the call. I mean, I, I'm, I'm here. I'm recording. Yeah. 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 Please, just take it down. Yeah. Please. No, no, no. This, this gives me more right to my office. You're not so. proving any point, though, brother. Well, what are they trying to hide? That's the question. We're not going to hide anything if we can have a meeting tonight. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Let's, let's, just, let's just don't just talk. Take it down. The chair is in control of the meeting. All right. Escort, Mr. Torres. Had someone play right into the hands of freaking law and yep. Yep. I mean you guys you speak all the rest in the hard way.
No, no, I'm protecting myself. You've involved the police, and now you've made it into an uh, even bigger issue. So, uh, so appreciate that. I got her. I appreciate them involving the police. That made it even to a bigger issue. So thank you. Appreciate it. I'll try to keep you out of it, but I can't make any promises. I mean, you, you should be pretty well versed in all this with police training and uh, First Amendment rights and everything. You too.